Hello again, The Real Count Gone Crazy here, back with another Dirt 5 video, and this time, at last, I can show you the full four-player split-screen mode here being played on Xbox Series X. And oh my goodness, what an incredible technical achievement this is. Firstly, it all appears to be running at 60 frames per second. Not even Mario Kart 8 Deluxe does that in four-player on Nintendo Switch, instead resorting to half the refresh rate in order to keep the detail up. There's no such backpedaling here, and despite such blistering speed, the draw distance here is phenomenal. Just look at it. it really does look and feel like four little versions of the single player game. Of course, it's a little bit illusionary, as the threshold for close up detail is understandably a little different. While playing, you will likely notice that the detail in the ground textures changes underneath you every now and then as puddles and the like are drawn in, and you can see a few more instances of detail drawn in in the middle distance. But these concessions are not only understandable, they're not game-breaking in the slightest, they just look a bit odd. In fact, a lot of the main game's best graphical effects are present here, like the day-night transitions and weather effects. What's more, all the footage you're seeing here was taken from the career mode campaign, so these are actual races that are being cleared to unlock the next events. You can play as a signed in gamer tag or play as a guest, so here we've got two players signed in on their gamer tags and two guests, and any cars that have been unlocked by the main player are available to the other players, but nothing more. You can use custom liveries, which are visible on all the screens, and the full array of camera views are available too. There's not even any reduction in animation frames for the driver's hands in cockpit view, unlike the last gen console versions, where the hands look very jerky indeed. This is, without doubt, the finest four-player split-screen mode I've ever seen. So while it ran fantastically on the base PS4, I must say the Xbox Series X version is outstanding. Well, that's about it for this video. I've made a Dirt 5 playlist now so you can check out my full review and the revised review of the Xbox One X version of the game, which was fixed quickly with a second patch soon after launch, as well as have an in-depth look at the Playgrounds mode and a look at how the single-player mode runs from a technical point of view on the Series X. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon. Cheers.